Welcome everyone, Farming Genius here. I noticed in the comments that many of you aren't fans of the AI voice, so I decided to record this tutorial myself. Today I will show you how to install mods and maps, but first I need to let you know that many of the mods right now might have different kind of bugs, so it will be a good idea to wait a bit until modders start uploading better versions. Ok, now let's start looking for the mods. So, let's type into your browser Farming Simulator 25 mods. I have this website ready because I've been downloading mods from here and they are working perfectly fine. So, let's choose one of the mods available here. Hmm, let's say. Let's say, what do I want? Hmm. Let's say I want this shed. So, click here. You have big green button, download mod. Click here. Then, create download, download file, and as you can see, I already downloaded a bunch of mods. So, I have the folder ready, but you guys probably will have to go to downloads because that's the default directory so let me save this in downloads okay right now we have to move this mod to our mods directory in farming simulator so click here on this little button as you can see you have the all downloaded files here so let's click copy or control plus C go to documents look for my games folder farming simulator 25 and here you have mods folder if you don't see this folder just click new folder and name it mods that's easy and if you you can have many mods folder just add one or two or three and you have you can have different mods and use them whatever you like like mod packs or something like this so let's delete this new folder and go to mods here we can click paste and as you can see our mod is now ready you don't have to unzip it or anything just leave it like that and it's gonna work so another thing how to install mod packs so I have mod pack right here it's made by not farming and it's for new farming 25 so Let's click download and save it to the downloads folder. Let's wait a bit. Okay, the mod pack is ready. So we have to do basically the same copy, go to documents my games fs25 and now we can create new folder mods1 copy here and our mods won't work right now because it's zipped into one big folder so we have to extract them all extract wait a bit So we have our mods ready. Right now, click Ctrl plus A, copy, go to mods, and paste it. Paste it here. Skip those these files that are the same, 
and we have all the new mods from the mod pack. It's really important to unzip mod packs first and copy all the zips from the folder to directly to the mods folder so they can work. Alright, now let's check if the mods are working. So I have my game on Steam and I'm gonna play, click play right now and we will see. They should be working but you know mods aren't perfect so our game might not start if we have some mods that aren't working. They might cause some problems but I don't think so that would be the case this time. Okay, let's start a new career. No, okay. And yes, they are all working. You can use backspace to select and deselect them all. Okay, so that will be fine. Now let's try to install a map. So let's go once again to the website, click maps, have some random map here, click download, create download, download, save, yeah, click here, copy, to documents, my games, FS25, mods and paste it here. As you can see I already have this map installed so I'm gonna click skip and let's go to let's go see if it's working. It should but you know let's check to be sure. Okay, let's see. As you can see, here it is, empty Riverbend Springs. That map that we installed like 20 seconds ago. So yeah, that will be all. Or no, wait, 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 wait. We have ModHub in the game. Download this content. Yeah, we have different categories. We can go to and look for the mods that we like and yeah if the we haven't got the mod installed in the right bottom corner we will have this button to install we click this okay it should be downloaded right yes it is because now we have an install button instead of install yeah, and we can do that with basically every one every single mod here so yeah as you can see it's pretty easy to install mods in farming simulator okay so that will be all if you have any questions just say them in the comments write them in the comments and you can guys let me know if you like tutorials that I record myself or I should stick to AI voice. Yeah, see you in the next tutorial.